woke up this morning, dipped it by past six. Easy motherfucking D with a hard ass dick. Nigga plotting, uh, nigga scheming. So don't wake me, bitch, cause I'm dreaming. Four I made seven zone bitches in my head, nigga up. Snowing like fuck, sleep in bed, got my nine. And I'm out the window, drunk as fucking high off that end. Oh, nigga, E, CPT, the OG. And I really don't think you wanna fuck with me, nigga. Walking half up with nine in hand. I gives a mad fuck, but they don't understand. Ah, where I'm up, where I'm up, where I'm up, where I'm up. Now back to the motherfucking set. Creeping, crawling, crawling, creeping. Easy E is an intensive care at Cedar Sinai Hospital, critically ill with full blown AIDS. Did you know he was HIV positive? No, we never knew. We never knew he was HIV positive. I share the sentiments of the family that we're all praying that uh, we'll get past this. Um, we just felt that given the nature of the, of, of the press and not necessarily saying the people that are here today felt that it was important for us to come forward to dispel any rumors and, and make sure that the truth be told. The rumors have been around for, I guess, a couple of weeks, and I guess today was the first time a lot of people got any confirmation that it was true. Person. And, uh, you know, I love him and I miss him to death and uh, his legacy will always live on in all of us. I'd like to say uh, congratulations to uh, Lil E up there and A-Dog, you know what I'm saying, they doing this thing. You know what I'm saying, Easy e look on to his son and uh, we're going to make it uh, possible to see him shine. The original Rufus, I don't know about any other Rufus, so I ain't going to speak on it. But uh, it, it's a beautiful thing, man, that uh, we get to see a second chapter. To my fans, I would like to say to my fans, uh, thanks for your support and uh, stay true to the game. And don't ever believe people who tell lies. Nigga make them in the circuit, cause me steadily reaping Noodle lay on the deep end, so me flip with a tip And it caught them sleeping, it's under the sun Just a bump and a click, and a ruthless move to Noodle lay to your big box, for the flops on deep Gotta make that cheese, I'm gonna get it Kill the killer, kill the killer, body to ground me Fuckin' them down, stiff down Burn them to style me, put them in the ground, now we die Sit up, up, and I bang, bang, bang Give in the room, but they come Till it's like this, I bang, bang This is for the DD A real cut in the city, city Uh, here tonight to um, pay tribute to my man Easy E, Eric Wright. It's all the same. Welcome to Compton, California, a pleasant enough neighborhood by day, a territory under siege at night. Straight out of Compton, the beats are as mean as the streets, and those who can rhyme in time have found quick fame under an apt new name, Gangster Rap. My name is Easy, yeah, this is true. Keeping your attention is what I'm gonna do. His name may be easy, but his message can be hard to take. It's the stuff that we've been through, you know. Stuff that we've seen and... Our buddy's been through, we've been through ourselves. It's not no act. I'm not a role model or a doctor, suit you. I'm a gangster, and I'm about to get stupid. Easy E was, in fact, a drug dealer. But he got smart, then got rich. For one, it's the money. For two, you're doing what you want to do. And three, you don't care what nobody say. His group is called MWA, which stands for... Niggas with Attitudes. But their attitude clearly bothers some in their own community. Many radio stations won't play rap records. MTV has refused to show NWA's latest video. People say we're promoting gang violence. We're not promoting gang violence at all. 
It's like we're just telling it like it is. We're, we're reporters. We're not doing nothing but, but making records that's real. And when it gets real, you know, it's like the truth hurts. Because the truth is so bitter. That's the way it goes in the city of Compton, boy. Uh, it's protesting the, uh, the way the LAPD handled the gang sweep a while back. They picked uh, black kids at random. You know, if you was in a certain age bracket, and uh, you looked a certain way on the street. You know, you went to jail just so they can get that, you know, so they can keep their statistics. So, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> so you can keep them up. Actually, they only probably arrested 60 real yeah. gang members. No gang members are stupid. If they hear about a gang sweep on the news, they're not coming outside. And they were getting, not stupid. They were getting <laughs> kids. They were getting innocent kids. But you in control the automatic. For any fool in my way, it starts static. We're like reporters. We just tell exactly how it is. And people don't like us because we don't take a stand. We're not on the good side of violence and not on the bad side of violence. We're in the middle. See, we look at it through through our own eyes and sometimes through gang members' eyes and, you know, do, through different people. And we take it in the first person and, you know, it's real and it's real crazy. So anybody with any kind of sense, without us telling them that's not the thing to do, would look at that and say, I don't even want to get involved. <laughs> We don't, we don't glorify, we don't, we're not pro-gang. The only thing you can get out of gang banging is, is maybe going to jail or dead. One of the two. That's where it's going to end up. We don't glorify, but it's so real, it's a thing to talk about. It's a thing that we have to talk about. A bad rap, say the rappers. On MTV, they play heavy metal music. They show people worshiping the devil and all this. But when we bring out a video telling the truth, how it is on the street, to show everybody so they can be aware of this, they don't want to play it. They say we promoting violence, promoting drugs. But I disagree with that. Oh, yo, this is how it is. You can die doing this, you can die doing that. If you want to do it like this and go get killed or go to jail, that's on you. The rappers themselves are straight out of Compton. MC Ren, Dr. Dre, Ice Cube, and Easy e On the album cover, that's Easy pointing the gun at the camera. I done been through the drug thing and the gang banging thing and a little bit of everything. Running from bullets. Bullets. <laughs> watching people get kicked. Standing next to people that got shot. People the reality. Tell exactly what's going on. You know, we call it we call ourselves reporters. We're not on the good side of violence and not on the bad side. We're right in between. But many in law enforcement fear that NWA's rap entices youngsters into crime by glamorizing street gangs and making police out to be the bad guys. A lot of people think because you wear baseball cap and you wear khakis and sneakers, you're going out to rob somebody. Are you going out to sell dope? Or you have a page and you, know, are you, you gotta be a drug dealer. Are you going by to make a drive by shoot? We're, we're dealing with the stereotypes, okay? The stereotypes is all young young blacks that dress a certain way of gangbangers. That's what we're dealing with, and it's unjust. I hear people talking about pulling out AKs, talking mm -hmm. about little girl being shot, but I don't care because I'm not a fool. Yeah. Now, that doesn't sound like an innocent guy. You ever got shot before? I got shot before on my leg, right? Just for hanging out at the wrong place at the wrong time. So, it, like, it all boils down to anybody can get shot. Anybody, anything can happen to anybody, and we're just letting everybody know this is how it is. Obviously, somebody is listening, in just six weeks, Straight Outta Compton has gone gold, selling more than half a million copies.
I see. What's up, Greg? Oh, in the house. Yeah. Hey, y'all. Hey, I need an interview, man. What's been happening, man? What are you going to do? Huh? What are you going to do, Arnold? I don't know, cuz. Just take, take this motherfucker back. <laughs> taking it to huh? I want to take it to the, to, to the university. <laughs> <laughs> we can have everything in the world, shit. You know. Hey, yo, dumb, dumb. Get the lumber pump, whack, whack. Then it's whack, whack. It's the slave pump. Time to pay the whack, pump. And let the real stuff you want. So you don't want to be low. Can you get smoked? Then I hope that the fans understand when you talk to my friend and me. The same records that you're making is playing me. Mother, Dre, mother, Snoop, mother, Death Row. Yo, when he comes, my left flow. Cause I'm the E-A-C-Y-E-S. This is the season to make the real Captain City cheese in. You like a kid, you follow the puppy, now you got one. But tell me where the hell you find the anorexic rap on. Talking about who you don't scrub with, who you shoot. You only see the girls when you're wearing boots. Damn, me, they tried to fade, you won't break it. Betray, they only make easy skate day. All of a sudden, Dr. Dre is the key thing. But on this whole album, that was he was the she thing. So suck up, please, suck up, please, don't step to these. Real come to City Jeans. I go there, Bradley. I'm Top Cat from Top Notch Video, man. Second year director, yeah. Glad it's all happening, man. It's all mellow. Thanks a lot, too. Exactly, exactly, exactly. It's good to see you having a suit and tie today. Well, no, I didn't think suit and tie would be appropriate for this. I came up with a cop in the city jeans. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. That's real. That's real, that's real. That's real. <laughs> Thanks a lot for the interview. No way, you ain't seen no parts of the street sheet. I think you started trying to bang around in time of the peace treaty. Wearing khakis and mob while you're wrong. Little faggot trying to snag it, but you're flooding at the same time. And your shit don't accept you. Yeah, you can't get rich, your homies, but you know they don't respect you. So brother, please, brother, please, don't step to me. We are talking city cheese. Well, it's the What's been happening, man? Not much. I see you put your foot down on the city, boy. <laughs> That's right. You're right, shit. Yeah. I love it, he. I love it. Big man, huh? See, young from the start, we are bring you on something. Come in my city, but try to do it for profit. So it's like y'all, it's what I call all the reason that nothing compared to real kind of city cheese. No, I don't like this stuff. The news brought many young rappers helped by EZE to the hospital. We letting people know what's real that can happen to you. So, you know what I'm saying? I guess he's making it a negative thing, more positive than it could. 
than just what it could be. Just like Magic Johnson, when he called it, you know, you just got to, like, figures that's out there, like, people that's out there that a lot of people, you know, like, role models, I guess you can say, when stuff like this happen, they just need to come out and speak and let other people aware of it so, you know what I'm saying, we can try to contain this stuff because it's getting bad. It's a solemn time for friends and family, people who only weeks ago celebrated triple platinum success and planned new projects. Instead, tonight, they pray. It's the closest we've ever been to, to the AIDS disease, you know, and it's just sorry, it's sad it had to happen to Easy e out of the economic chains of the inner cities and he gave them the kind of music that they wanted to hear. He was an innovator. He was a creative 
original thinker. He conceptualized. And anybody that he touched will never be the same. I know that he made me better than I was, as he did to Dre and Ice Cube, and all of us who were there at the beginning. He was the kind of person that could make two plus two equal five. We're going to miss him very much. Very sorry, Kenny. That's right. Thanks for that mental doubt. Yeah. When I say homies forever, I go way, way back to before you pioneered gangster rap. All that. So rest in peace knowing that what you started musically, we gonna finish. Most definitely. Ever. And that's the thing. That's right. So trust that what lies behind us and lies before us are tiny compared to the love that lies within us. We all. We all love you, homie. Forever. Amen. Mm -hmm. Darlings, we have come literally <laughs> the last mile of the way. You can't go any further than this when you're made of flesh and blood. Yeah. We've said easy, we, we were with you when you breathed. Amen. We were with you till the final step. Yeah. But you know, the concern isn't with easy. Mm -hmm. It's with us, the yes. living. Yeah. With us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because in his blood, it is a world we can't even imagine. It is a world larger than anything we can imagine. A God larger. Our task 
is to take from the youngest children here today yes. up to us the elders yes. and to love one another yes. to stop hurting one yes. another yes. Yes. if I have bread you hungry yes. you have yes. bread yes. if you need I have if yes. I need you have yes. we are family yes. Amen. and if we can make that commitment then his living has meant something beyond even himself. Yes. Let's remember the families yes. now. Yes. The days will get long for yes. them from now. Very long. Yes. They've given up a portion of themselves. Yes. And anybody can stand with them today. But it takes somebody to call yes. them up and say, I just called to say yes. I love yes. you. Oh, yeah. Amen. And I mean it from the bottom of my yes. heart. Yes. For as much as it has pleased Almighty God mm -hmm. to receive from this world the soul of our departed brother and son, yes. Ezra Wright, we therefore commit his body to the ground, earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust, looking for the general resurrection in the last days and the life to come. Yes. Eric Wright. Yes. Whence forth the blessed shall rise yes. in the Lord. Yes. By the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, yes. and the fellowship of his Holy Spirit be with you until we meet again. Yes. Amen. Looking through the windows of my mind Of what we used to go through The good and bad times I can't see.
Hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, Much love to you, my nigga. Hey, Thank you, you really give it up like that for the love, 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 You know what I'm saying? Always gonna do that. Get the underworld. Damn, a record sale. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Get the underworld. They love. Get the underworld record sale. Oh, you know how it is with me and underworld. We go way back. What's side for life. My niggas help blow that up. Leave it. Much love to you. All right, baby.
know? Exactly. You gotta thank God for what you got, you know. Because exactly. exactly. OGs ain't promised the next day. Exactly. That's, that's uh, what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, damn. It's going down. You always gotta remember the good people for you you never look at the negative side, you always look at the positive side because mm -hmm. We all put on this earth to make mistakes, but then we got positive sides. We actually repent and do all that. And that what Eric was, even in his death, you know, that what represented all what we doing today. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Exactly. Just because of what he was talking about, mm -hmm. whatever he represented at the time, he was having beef with people. Mm -hmm. He still allowed us, you know what I'm saying, to make the kind of records we do today. He was making mm -hmm. the type, type of real stuff. In the streets, eh? <laughs> Keeping that street creativity going, oh, man. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, man. Appreciate that, dog. Yeah, sure, man. Check it out, Mr. Kane. It's coming at you. Yeah. It's coming at you. Watch out.
what's up, man? You see? Rest in peace, easy motherfucking E. We want to say much love for all that love on the box and shit. Let me see that shit. This nigga made that shit real. You know? Hey, we want to thank everybody in this motherfucker. All the West Coast, East Coast support, y'all give a bone. You know what I'm saying? Well, somebody put out a motherfucking instrument on something out of the way.
Give it all up for both thugs in harmony, y'all. And we love y'all motherfuckers, y'all. Both thugs, y'all. Both thugs. Ruthless record recording on it. Uh, here tonight to um, pay tribute to my man Easy E, Eric Wright. It's all the same. Um, it has been six years since he passed on, man. And we uh, and every year I want to always do the best that I can to always represent his name uh, and his legacy. And I am uh, I'm just very happy to be you know a part of this whole thing. And and uh, because Eric was the person that really put me on the radio and, and guided my my life into this direction over here. And uh, it's been a, an incredible ride, you know. I gotta tell y'all, I always thank y'all, 
and as an audience, you know what I mean, as an audience, I always thank you because it's, it's been a long ride for me, man, it's been a, a real experience, you know, a real crazy experience, and today when I got up, I was like, I don't know, you know, every time I do this, this, this Easy E tribute thing every year, I don't know if it's going to be my last one at the radio station, but I just know that every year that I get another year to do it, I'm going to do it and put it down and represent this real deal thing here, man, with Easy E, man, because a lot of people seem to forget about, you know, his influence on his music and what his music is all about, you know, and you see all the artists now that have uh, become huge and just big off this music, you know what I mean, it all started from Eric Wright, man, so we're going to take it back for you right here, we're going to play some Easy E for you tonight, but we're going to celebrate this brother, you know, his life and his legacy and his music, and I'm, I'm honored to have his son here, his older son here to hang with me, man, so uh, thank you for coming through, Louie, I appreciate it, bro. No just lay back, brother. We gonna have some music. <laughs> it's all good. Y'all wanna hear something? You know what to do, man. One eight 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 six nine six one zero zero three. Wherever easy may be, man. I'm, 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 I know he's smiling. Man. I'm trying to ride for him to the floor. <laughs> <laughs> you so started, everybody. Y'all lay back, just chill. Check it out. to get into your cut though man it's different easy man and uh um i gotta had to dig it up last night and i pulled it out i said you know what people are gonna trip man cocaine is way ahead of his time man oh man god bless you man and yeah. uh man it's just, you know without e you know what i'm saying and, and remembering his legacy man we wouldn't be here you know what i'm saying yeah. none of us you me yeah and uh it's just a blessing that you know that we had him around you know for him to do what he did so we can all you know be able to shine, right? You know, it's a trip cocaine that it's like, uh, Easy always, I always said this about Easy, man. He, he seen things in people that people didn't really see in themselves at the time, you know. He, he, uh, he definitely, like, you know, he had you out at one time, and, you know, sometimes he was a little too early on people, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, well, see, that man had a vision, man. He, you know, he was the type of person you, you know as well as I know. He come into a room real quiet. Be like, nah, man, I think this is like this. And you wouldn't understand it right away. Yeah. Two or three months along the line, man, you, you realize, man, that man, that man yeah. was heavy. Yeah, no doubt, man. I want, I want to ask you something, Cocaine. I, I want you to to explain, you know, because I've, I've heard different things from different people on, 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 the, on the tribute song. Uh, some people didn't understand the lyrics when, I know there was one part in the song where you say, Easy, Easy had his scandalous days and, and that, that whole line. Sometimes, you know, people, you know how people are, hey, they take lines differently. Right. But since you wrote it, you know, uh, could you explain, you know, the whole the whole message and what you were saying in that song? Well, well what I mean to say is like, you know, nobody perfect, man. Yeah. Everybody rock, walk, got their own patterns of road, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Some people yell at big roads, turn up to broken concrete. Mm -hmm. Right. And it's just like the same thing. It's like, you know, I used to see Dre and Easy, you know, paddle, you know. No, I don't think it's like this. I think it's like this. Right. But it's like, you still, for, for good or for bad, man, his, his good outweighed his bad side. Man. No doubt, no doubt. And uh, it's just like with anything, I'm not perfect myself, man. And it's like I got a gang of partners around me um, that just see the good in me. And that's the, that's the same thing I've seen in Eric, man. Eric was a good, genuine person. Yeah, no doubt. And, uh, you know, I love him and I miss him to death. And uh, his legacy will always live on, man, and all of us. No doubt. And congratulations to you, brother. I can't wait to hear your album, man. Oh, yeah, man, it's going down. I'd like to say uh, congratulations to uh, Lil E up there and A-Dog, you know what I'm saying? They doing this thing, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Easy E lives on through his son. No doubt. And uh, we're going to make it uh, possible to see him shine the original Rufus. I don't know about any other Rufus, so I ain't going to speak on it. But uh, it, it's a beautiful thing, man, that uh, we get to see a second chapter. No doubt, no doubt. That's within his son, you know what I mean? No doubt. Well, let's get talking to you, Cocaine. Thanks for calling in. Too, man, God bless you. He's on in everything, Doc. Yeah, yeah, he got it, Doc. Yeah. Hold it. All right, get it closer. Let it feed. How you doing, loved one? Yes, sir. Keeping confident floats, you know. Oh, What's up, man? Yes, sir. You know we got a little here record label, right? Uh -huh. A little Eric. Is that right? Yeah, it's for Lil' E, man. She make bites for Lil' Eric or something? Yeah. She make bites. Put it down and regulate it like your daddy did. That's real. <laughs> 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 
slide and slide. Not the big one, too, man. <laughs> yeah. That's real. Okay, take a picture. Cam, what do you got to say to the Leisha. people out there? <laughs> <laughs> Any parting words a little easy, man? He got a little label, you know, he's starting a little label, oh, man. Yeah, man, uh, just no matter what, man, be positive. Yeah. Stay positive. Yeah. You know, just like his father already showed right there, you can't do it. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. the plugs. Exactly. All you got to do is stay high to be successful. Exactly. Start where he left off. Exactly. You should fit it in beyond like that. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It was homeboys. I thought you were gonna give it up, but you yeah, know it's all yeah, good. They was rushing us and stuff, yeah, man. Yeah. I was like, God, dog. Me and Janine made positive people know. say to the family because you know we're gonna shoot a shot to the family. Yeah, well, the best thing to do is uh, stay together. Yeah. You know, stay on the one because easy is what we uh, we're all headed for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. and uh, you know, let's just stay strong, keep it all on the one. Yeah. And uh, the funk will definitely survive. It's gonna survive hey, forever. You we're know, gonna it. take it to the universe. You know it. All right. Yeah. All right. Love Eric Wright. Rest in peace. 1963 to 1995. We loved him a lot, but God loved him more. That's real. We just came back from the Ace Memorial Quilt and Rose Bowl, Sandy. Paying our respects, keeping his legacy alive. Compton, you know, doing keeping it real, showing the world that uh, one way or another, his legacy will stay alive. Through all ways necessary, through music, most of all. So many brothers know, recognize him, and understand what type of brother he was about. Those who didn't know him, now you get to see him in a whole nother fashion, bigger than the world. He got a hell of a view out here. You know what I'm saying? He look at, he look up, he, he on top of the world right now. Looking out at everything. What you're seeing now is a view where he look at every morning when he wake up. Yeah, sun shining good. It's all good. It's a beautiful thing. You know, we couldn't get out here on his birthday, but yeah, we here today. And that's what counts. You know what I'm saying? He's love, you know that, homie. Forever. Homie's forever. You know. But uh all I wanna say is to Miles, his family, and everybody out there, Tris. One way or the other, y'all gonna see this. I don't know when y'all gonna see this, but uh it's gonna happen. And when y'all do see it, I want y'all to know that my love goes to y'all as well, and the whole family, and all his kids and everything. We're gonna keep doing this, and y'all gonna see this. Y'all gonna see this one day. Y'all gonna see this. Y'all gonna see this. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah. We doing this. Just yeah. chilling. Yeah. We're gonna go on the skirt up out of here, you know. Mm -hmm. We had to make sure the homie was looking shiny before we left. Mm -hmm. You know, glycerin. You know, 
Eric Wright. You know, we loved him. Yeah. Still you know, do, you know. But the Lord loves him a lot more. Yeah. Man. We're going to get on up out of here. Yeah. Make sure I throw this whole trash away. Uh huh. We out. Peace, baby. Yeah. 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 Now we're kicking back, getting blasted Reminiscing how she looked in a casket Paid my respects and didn't shed a tear Easy motherfucking eat, sleepy tea, and I'm out of here Rest in peace